taking aim at his ultimate dream. He's a professional darts player and lives right here in the Edmonton area and has a very short-term plan to stand on top of the world. If you want to be successful in anything, you have to set goals. And you have to start out with small goals. I've reached every single goal and I have one left. And I only have a year to do it. I said I wanted to be a world champion by the time I was 40. The 39-year-old moved to Edmonton 14 years ago from Sydney, Nova Scotia and has been playing darts for three decades. He's represented Canada nationally and internationally. Went to uh, top 64 in the world in about four or five months, my first time on the tour. I came home, I won my Canadian, I won the Canadian championship. But while he was on tour, there was one moment he experienced that most could hardly imagine. When you think of darts, you think of Phil Taylor. I dreamt, I don't know how many times, about beating the man on TV. Probably the biggest moment in my career ever. Uh, it was only a short format, but it was still a 16-time world champion. And to beat him was just, it was amazing. In the meantime, McNeil takes on all comers in the Edmonton City Dart League and is admired by his peers for his... Consistency and pressure shots. When, they, when you need that shot, you need that shot. Yeah, there's a lot of people that get jacked when they beat Kenny because Kenny's been there. He knows what it's like on stage. Edmonton has some of the best players. Every year, uh, Darts Alberta, we have our provincials and we take the top eight. And every year we go to the nationals. We always, we're always in the money round, or the medal round. But in order to obtain his goal of being a world champion in the next 365 days, the scaffolder by trade knows he has to stay focused. Since uh, I left work Christmas Day, and from then on I was doing probably 10 to 12 hours a day on the board. My wife, she's very supportive, she's a dark player as well. There's not a lot of women that would put up with their man going away for six, seven months at a time to live their dream. If and when McNeil gets another crack at going pro, it's a packed trip, 54 tournaments in 52 weeks. It's all over England. Uh, you have the Euro European Championships, which are in Germany and Holland and Belgium and all that. And this time, I'm not going to stay over there. I'm actually going to fly back and forth. So hopefully I do well enough that I can afford that, because if not, I'm going to be broke very quick. For Go, I'm Dave Dawson.